Hello guys, in this today video, I am going to show how to log into the Cisco Networking Academy. Right, so how to log into the Cisco Networking Academy, how to access the particular course which is assigned by your instructor. So first thing is that before going to log into the Cisco Networking Academy, first your network instructor or your college instructor will forward something like this. For registration of the course, you will receive some link from your instructor from your college. Suppose this is the link which I received from my instructor. So first I am going to enroll to the particular course. Once it is completed, we are going to log into the Cisco Networking Academy. So here we need to provide our what mail ID as well as the password in order to access this particular code. So in the first step, what exactly we are going to do is whatever the link provided by your instructor. So just click on this link. That link you will be you will get from your instructor, right? So it is loading, right? <clears throat> now see that here we have the task Cisco VIP. This details you will be getting as per your instructor, right? So now see that here we are going to enroll the course. So first here what you have to do is select the country, right? So I am going to select India, then your birth of the month, right? So select whichever is appropriated for you. So once it is completed, then you select your <coughs> this one, right? So something like this, right? So once next click on the next account details. Here exactly we need to provide as you people register for Cisco virtual internship programming, right? So if you are registered Cisco virtual internship program, you have provided your first name as well as the last name, right? The same thing here you need to provide, right? For example purpose, I'm giving some random name. So you should give your first name as well as the last name, right? So then provide your email ID. So here one important point that you need to remember is that Whichever mail ID you have given for registering, I mean while registering the Cisco virtual internship program on AACT, right? So that same mail ID used here. Probably most of them used their college mail ID, better use that. So whichever the mail ID you have given while you are registering for the AACT virtual internship, that mail ID only you need to use here, right? So once it is completed, then here you need to select the state. Right, so then you need to answer this question 1 plus 2 equal to what something 3. So click on this one, <coughs> then click submit. So here you will be finding something right there. Thank you, enrolling to get started. We email the activation link to so you will receive activation link to this mail ID. Right, so follow the instruction to access your course. Right. If did not receive this mail, we can click on the recent activation mail. Now, what exactly we are going to is that so after filling this detail, we will be getting the link to our particular mail ID, whichever the mail ID we have given for that we will be getting this link. Right. So now before doing this process, you better log in with your mail ID. So this is my mail ID which I have given. Right. So for this one here, you will be getting the verification link. So see that I have received the mail from the networking academy. Just click on this. So here you will be finding exactly so your name first name as well as the last name welcome to the cisco networking academy so to activate your account please click the button below right so first itself we need to activate the account then only we can able to access the whichever the course which is assigned by our instructor right so for that just click here to proceed now here we need to create our password actually we know that what is our mail id Whatever the mail ID you have given, that is your username. Now here you need to create your password, right? So whichever is the password you created, so try to remember that is the most important point, right? So I'm going to create a password. <coughs> so just once it is completed, click on submit. If you want, you can save it. If you are using your own computer, something like that. So here your account is updated, right? So now here we have the two platforms. So most of the courses that we are going to do under the NetAcad, nothing but the Cisco Networking Academy. So nothing but this one, right? So now what you have to do is just click on Networking Academy, right? Now here you need to provide your what? You need to provide whichever email ID you registered. So once it is completed, click on Login, right? So after entering the password, click on login. Now here you need to fill all these details. 
right so i agree to provide so complete all those which are is relevant so next gender fill the all the details so what is your practical something less than 1 year 2 years none so like that you completed once it is completed you just create account click on create account now if you observe here see that close it here you will be finding that this course is assigned for you right so what what actually we have done is for the accessing this course we have clicked this link which are the which are it is sent by your college instructor now exactly this course is assigned to you right so now what you can do is just click on the launch course if you click on the launch course you will find the data or course content related to everything so you need to complete module by module so if you want further information just click on next otherwise you skip the tour right so here something like this we will be having right so you need to complete the all the chapter the main important thing to get the certificate what you have to do is first you complete the course feedback right so click on the course feedback then complete it once it is completed then you can click on the final exam and you take the final exam so that certificate will be generated here automatically this is the thing you need to do right so if you want you can go to your home page so just click on the home so here you can access your course so your instructor is assigned only one course if multiple courses are assigned here you can find so most important point remember that once you completed the feedback exam as well as the final exam then here you will be getting the something download your certificate so it means that you have completed your course right so this is the one way of the logging right so now suppose for example now we have created our what our username as well as the password right so for the next time so how to access means just you go to the google then click on the netacad login right so just click on the netacad login so here you will be finding the cisco networking academy just click on cisco networking academy right so then just click on the login again click on the login so what here you have to provide is you need to provide your email id so nothing but whichever email id then you create the password that you have to give then this course will be enabled now we will see that what will be happen for the some student what are the problem that they will face that we are going to address is now and it means that the moment when you are clicking on this link so it is asking for our email id basic details that we need to enter next account details once it is completed now what will be happen means few students they will not get the something like this few students they will not get the verification mail id something like this right so in this case what you have to do suppose if you didn't get the any mail id so now what you have to do means then simple thing you need to do is again you go back to the netacad login right in this case if you are not getting the verification mail id to create your new account again you click on the cisco networking academy right so here you go to login then this is the important point click on recent activation link means after registering if you didn't get the verification link for creating the new account in cisco networking academy if you get you follow that previous procedure so that you can get the access to the course if not you didn't get mail then what you have to do is just click on the recent activation mail right, right. now what you have to do means here we need to provide our email id right. it means that suppose if you didn't get the activation link to register into or create the new account now what you can do is click on recent activation mails after clicking on the recent activation mail so whatever the mail id you have entered here you will be getting something like this then whatever we discussed in the previous the same thing you need to follow here so that you can get the access to your courses then what is the next case right some people they have already part of the cisco networking academy right so they have already login credential now what they have to do is just click on the link whichever the course assigned by your instructor then fill the all your details once it is completed again you don't need to require and again you you do not require to activate your mail id and you don't require to go to this one go to mail id then activate account it does not require what straight away you can do is if you have the email id as well as the password which is already done you are accessing the this course one more time so just click on the netacad login go to netacad login once it is done this click on the first cisco networking academy straight away you go and give your details right so you give your login name as well as the password so so that after giving your login name and password directly you will be getting the 
access to your course right so this is how we are going to access the course for the first time if you have already account then click on the link do register then again go to networking academy then log in so this will work out for you yeah now we will discuss the one more the problem that was student will pages they will be having the login credential right but they when they are trying to log into the netacad login nothing but cisco networking academy what they have to do is they need to provide your username nothing but mail id as well as the password which is created already so for that they have to click on the login right so the moment they click on the login what it will ask is it will ask our email id right suppose if you enter your email id so in this case what will be happen means if you click on login right so it will ask for the password right now this point we are going to what we are going to concentrate here is suppose you know your mail, mail id and you forgotted your password in this case what you have to do is just click on forget password right so next click on forget password then enter your email address to receive the instruction for creating the password at the rate of gmail.com something like this once it is done you just click on submit right so then you will receive the mail so there you will be getting the guidelines how to reset your password right so i hope this video will be helpful for enrolling into cisco networking academy and how to access your code and how to complete your course by completing the feedback exam final exam right so thank you very much guys